because it picks up irregular heartbeats. The watch on Mark Cry's hand does a lot more than tell time. It monitors his heart. He's had trouble with his ticker for years. My girlfriend says, I'm going to buy you an eye watch. So she buys me the eye watch. I put it on. Sure enough, it says I have AFib. I go to my cardiologist. It says I got AFib. He puts the monitor on me. Sure enough, I had AFib. One of the biggest things we worry about is that it increases your risk for having a stroke. And so for some patients, their first sign of AFib might actually be a massive stroke. Actually can help prevent some of this progressive changes in the heart. Mark eventually came to see cardiac electrophysiologist Dr. Sanjeet Sidhu at MedStar Union Memorial Hospital. Mark underwent cardiac ablation surgery to correct his out-of-sync heartbeat and is doing well. Dr. Sidhu says the smartwatch technology Mark okay. used can really help patients monitor their health. Now I can monitor my heart rate. I can check if I feel like I'm having symptoms to find out if I'm having AFib. If I have AFib, then of course I'm going to call Dr. Sidhu right away. This is an iPhone 5. For symptomatic patients like Mark. So they click an EKG app on their watch and they hold their hand up to the crown of the watch and it creates a one lead EKG or one lead rhythm strip. And that does it for about 30 seconds and then the watch will do apply some AI to say whether it thinks it's AFib or not AFib. And the other nice thing about it is that it saves that recording so that you could send it to your doctor if you're concerned. Refractory atrial fibrillation. If you're an asymptomatic patient and AFib happens without you realizing it. Then it can detect your pulse. Well, it does it one step further by also detecting an irregular pulse. And if it detects an irregular pulse, it can alert you to say that your rhythm is irregular. Please see your doctor because you might have AFib. I gave it a try. It's really easy to set up, and I'm not good at this kind of stuff. All you have to do is tap on the watch app on your smartphone, scroll down to heart, as you see here, and tap on right there. Then tap on irregular rhythm right there. And now my watch is monitoring me for AFib. Dr. Sadu says this technology helps people take control of their own health care, but he cautions. We can generate some false positives, meaning it can lead to downstream testing that may not have been necessary. And also, it may give patients some false sense of security. So what I'd like to leave patients with is that, or people with, is that just because your Apple Watch tells you that everything is normal doesn't mean that everything is normal. So if you're feeling some concern or some symptoms, please go see your doctor.